Now just a quick uh, update on how to back up your ECOS. Um, so basically it backs up all the settings on the ECOS in case you mess up or in case you have a failure on the command station so you can restore it to a new one etc or whatever you want to do. So basically you got spanner, spanner menu, set up number one on the top and you go to IP uh, button now I'll show you your IP address on the top. Those numbers on the top of whatever it says there you want to put into your internet browser, which I'm going to do here now. So um, you put it in the top address bar and hit return. Oops, hit yourself as well. Uh, and basically you get this menu which uh, comes up in German. You got to make sure you press English unless you're German, and then you'll get all the information of the ECOS, etc., and your computer, whatever. And you want to make sure you don't press uh, restore configuration or reset device, otherwise it'll wipe it clean the ECOS. So you press store configuration, and then you wait a while. Following information will be stored, local list, list of accessories and routes, system config, easy defined images, and you press store settings. And you've got to wait a short while for it to uh, access the next menu. And then eventually you will get this menu, file download. Um, now you've got to be patient for this to come up, it does take a while, and eventually it comes up. Uh, do you want to open or save this file, which it's named there, ecos2 backup. So I'm going to go save, and then you, you go to where you want to save it basically. I'm saving mine on a memory stick, which is actually a Swiss Army knife as well. So I'm going to search for that, which is my G drive. There it is. There's my previous backup, or you could name that somewhere else if you want, whatever you want to do. Anyway, all you do then is press save. It already exists, you want to overwrite it. Yeah. And there you go, it's doing it. Sometimes it does it quick, sometimes it takes a while. Uh, if you've overwritten it a few times, it, it tends to take a little bit longer. And that's it. All the configuration of the ECOS is saved. So there we go. Download complete. And close. Everything backs up on the, on the memory stick. I have two memory sticks to back up. Two configs, just in case. Um, if you have any problems, try using a different uh, uh, internet search engine like uh, Chrome or uh, Safari, whatever. If you have any problems, just try something else. Uh, if you have any problems, we've tried to do it. Also, clear the download cache of any old ECOS files and you should have a fresh start then. So, it's pretty easy to do anyway. So, that's it. Just a tip.